It is a wild world we live in. Have you guys been keeping up with going, what's going on with like Aurora, Colorado? It's super scary because these Venezuela gangs just came in and completely took over an apartment complex, leaving all these people homeless. The people with authority are not doing anything. They will not do anything. Um, they have tried to contact them. They're like, nope, we're not touching that. What are we supposed to do when we live in the U.S.? So what's happened is these um, gangs have shown up. They have lots of GU, you know, and I'm talking like military grade. And they stand outside these complexes. No one's allowed to go in. Only their people can go in and out. Um, one of the buildings they've completely, it's in livable right now. It's, they gave it back to the landlord, just completely trashed. Um, they've been robbing stores that sell these GU, you know, um, can't say that on here. They've been uh, robbing jewelry stores. Um, they collect the rent from the people because they still are supposed to pay the rent, but the rent's not going anywhere. So it's like, this is scary because Colorado is definitely more of a central state. So if you don't think something fishy is going to go on before election, you need to, I don't, I don't even care where you get your news source. That is scary because if they can go to Colorado and take over not one, but several apartment complexes and get away with it, what else do you think they can do? So keep your head on a swivel. I think things are gonna get really, really fishy before election. Who knows what's gonna happen? We definitely need a president with a backbone and one that shuts our borders because if my aunt had to come over here legally, they all should have to also. That's my Monday rant.